up at Windy Harbour uh, for a couple of days. Uh, we just thought we'd go for a bit of a look out because I'm um, bored shitless uh, sitting in the caravan. Um, Fee's been doing some uh, some editing and stuff but uh, we decided uh, we'd give our legs a bit of a, uh, exercise and come down and have a look at a few things. Took it's our Ugg boots off yeah. and our flannelette. <laughs> nah, but um, there's a couple of things around here. Um, Cathedral Rock was pretty nice. Um, set, we're, we're at Salmon Beach at the moment. It's a look out Salmon Beach. It's beautiful. Yeah. Other than the grey uh, clouds. Yeah. <laughs> All around. But the sun's trying to poke its head through. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, it stops yeah. us from being bored. So we'll let you know what this is before we get out because it's very, very windy. It's called the Cliff Window Lookout. Correct. Okay, near Windy Harbour. And it's in which national park? Uh, I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce it. The Dion Tricasto. Yeah, that's the one. Dion Tricasto. You say it. Oui, oui. Oui, oui. Dion Tricasto. Yeah, it's there. It's in that one. Yeah, there's a there's. M bigger. I'll put it up on the screen because it's just the alphabet. Yeah. Anyway, so we'll just show you this one. It's a bit of a walk. And wind. And wind. We left Windy Harbour mm -hmm. this uh, morning. This morning, it was windy, and it was a harbour, and it was raining. <laughs> <laughs> and we found this gem of a spot, which is called Glenbrook Camping. Glenbrook Camping, and it's um, not far from Margaret River. Um, just beautiful. It's a private property, but they have uh, toilets and showers and big open space. I think she just said that they have maximum 12 yeah. uh, vans or 12. They're not really sites because it's just sort of pull up wherever you like. But it's beautiful. Yeah, nice kangaroos and Kangaroos quiet. and horses and yeah. more kangaroos and yeah. in a bush setting and um, gorgeous. Really nice. Peaceful. And $20 a night. Yeah. So we'll show you. And you have toilets and showers. Did you say toilets I and showers? I did toilets oh, and did? showers. Okay, toilets and Not showers. Not that we use the toilets and showers. No. But, but there is toilets and showers. Yeah. And so, a camp yeah. kitchen. But really pretty. Pretty yeah. setting and, yeah. and nice and peaceful. And close to, uh, to everything yeah. if you want to use it as a base. So we'll have a look around. Yeah.
So that's us right over the back there. Nice and peaceful. And there's probably oh, about seven, seven or eight, maybe other campers. Yeah, beautiful. So we're parked up at Hamlin Bay, Caravan Park. It was a bit gloomy when we got there yesterday. So we haven't showed you around yet. It's still well, gloomy. It's still, still gloomy. But come, uh, come to WA, they said. Yes, it would be nice. Um, They're just making us feel like we're at home in Melbourne. Uh, yes, that's right. It's Melbourne weather mm -hmm. in WA. Yeah. We should have gone north earlier, but you know, we'll show you around still. We'll show you inside caves, which we're doing today. Jewel Cave, and what was the other one? Lake. I Lake think Cave, Lake we're Cave. going to. Mm. And then we're going to go down to a lighthouse at Cape Lewig. Is Lu it? Lewin. Lewin, Cape Lewin. Lewin. Yep. And have a look at Augusta. Yeah, maybe. Augusta, yeah. yeah. So, yes. Come with us. Come with us. And have a look. Come down to just past Augusta to Cape. Well, I don't know. Cape, <laughs> Cape Lu 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 Luin. 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 Yeah, Cape Lewin. Um, we'll put it up. Yeah, and the the, the 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 word is that this is the tallest um, or the largest lighthouse in Australia, 30 meters tall. And have a look at this. It's got bloody scaffold around it and they're <laughs> painting it or something. Not happy, Jan. No. Mr. WA, you know, like you've had two years of COVID to get all this ready for us mm -hmm. and what's going on? Anyway. Next. Next. We're, we're trying to see things, really nice things, you know, like in your state. And uh, we come to the tallest lighthouse in Australia at Cape Lewig. Lewin. Lewin. <laughs> we'll get Lewin. it right one day. We'll get it right. It's like Albany. It should be Albany. But anyway. Um, yeah, so we come down to the water wheel, which is very historical apparently. So it was built in 1895 to supply water for the builders of the lighthouse. 
Looks like they're at it again. I wonder if they need water. Yeah. Good morning everyone, we're here at, where are we? Hamlin Bay. Hamlin Bay. And it's a nice little caravan park. Um, it's how much a night? Oh, uh, what was oh, I've stumped her. Yeah, uh, 45? Yeah, yep. 45. Yep, and uh, we're here for four nights. Yep. And it's a nice day today. So we're going to go for a walk down the beach. And uh, according to the uh, locals, there's some stingrays floating around in the shallows and uh, an old wharf we want to go and uh, take some pictures of some timber hanging out of the water some remains remains and uh, just show you around we're trying to get a picture of the jetty jetty oh jetty and look <laughs> We've come into Bustleton for the day and we're having a look around. The first port of call is the Bustleton Jetty, which is uh, apparently spectacular. And the precinct itself uh, is pretty good. Yeah, Just uh, turn it around and have a look. There's a brewery and uh, there's new buildings going up and it's nice grassy areas. And, and it's a sunny day today. And it's a sunny day. Anyway, let's, let's uh, have a look. Ready? Yeah. So we're here at the Bustleton Jetty and uh, some information. Uh, it was built in 1865. Mm -hmm. um, in 1978 uh, it was destroyed by a cyclone and in 1987 I think it was, yeah. it was rebuilt again. So now we get to enjoy the Bustleton Jetty, which is 1.8 kilometers long. Yeah. It costs you four dollars to walk to the end, and there's a there's a um, a train. A train. I'm not sure how much that don't is. Don't know how much that is yet, but we'll let you know. And um, there's also an aquarium or a, a viewing area at the end. I think to... it's um, an uh, underwater observer. Yep, yep, yep. 
underwater observatory. Yeah, so it's... Uh, but like you've you also can, got to pay for it. Yeah, I think you can walk down and you can just see what's under the jetty. You know, a few fish hanging around the pylons and stuff like that. So we'll just show you that as well. It's a very, very busy, popular place. Very. However, busy. it is school holidays also. Yeah. So we'll take you there. So that was Bustleton. Uh, we went to the pier, did the whole walk along the pier, which was pretty good. Gave us uh, room to put our lunch again. And uh, now we're down in Yelling Up, uh, just or just out of Yelling Up. It's called Canal Canal Rocks. Canal Rocks, and this is the Canal Bridge Canal at Rocks Canal Bridge. Rocks. So we'll just take you out there and show you that. Once again, the landscape gardener has done a perfect job of placement of rocks.
Perpen we're lost. Perpendicular <laughs> to, <laughs> to ocean, take that one. Go at low tide if possible. A spectacular spot for snorkeling. Okay. We're off again. Bloody tree roots everywhere. That rocks. Well, I've got my safety thongs on again. <laughs> Declining. We're declining. We're declining. Are we declining? Okay. The ocean's still a long way away. Well, at least we might be able to kill two birds with one stone here because I'm thinking we're going to be here still at sunset. Yeah, this is a good idea. That over there is the aquarium. So we've come to the Black Brewing Company, which is just out of Yellinger on the uh, Caves Road. And uh, it's got a few ciders. We like cider, we don't like beer. Nice grassed area. Nice lake. Beautiful setting. Croquettes. Yeah, corn. We've got um, chicken thingy. Chicken doobies. 
Turkish bread and some duka and olive oil and stuff. And They're buffalo wings, the chicken. Buffalo wings, chicken, uh, no, these are chips. And we've got a pint of pale ale, pale ale. a pint of ginger beer, and a tasting pellet. Of gin and, uh, gin and mixes. Gin mixes, yeah. So uh, there's four. Not there. So we'll see you in about a week. <laughs>